Anna Zelopukina. Remember, scores are held until all three are complete and only the top three teams advance. And you know, Greg, I think this was great strategy by Zella Bikina. She's Ukraine. competing on floor exercise instead of balance beam. Zella it's a much more Bikina. stable event, and she's probably going to go out there and do a solid routine at this point in time. It's a good exercise for her. Well, Greg, as I said, a good choice strategy-wise for Svetlana. Not an incredible routine, but really doesn't have any major errors. This was the only one that was close to an error, her dismount. It's a handspring front with a full, just has a little bit too much power right here, and kind of bounds forward. The question is, Tim, was this good enough to knock the USA out? Well, I would say it's going to be very close, but I'd say yes, actually. USA total score, once again, was 27.95. Here are the scores. The scores for the mixed pair from Ukraine and Czech Republic. Score for Andrea Zemeshchipa, 9.35. Good score from the rhythmic gymnast. Score for Valery Goncharov, 9.4. Score for Svetlana Zelopukina. We don't have yet. <laughs> well, a look at the figures tells us that anything over a 9.25 in the USA is out of the competition. Well, 9.25, I would Score say that Svetlana she's definitely going to have that. 9.6. And, and the that 9.6 means that yeah. the USA will not advance to the finals, and we can trace it back to John Roethlisberger's fall, can't we? Uh, Gymnast for this, for this team, team advancing to the balance beam, Svetlana Zelopukina. Greg, I think Svetlana has saved the best for last. This exercise is just packed with difficulty from start to finish. Here comes one of her big tricks right here. Ariel Cartwell watches the two layouts. That is tough stuff. She does it so well, too. Beautiful toes and knees. As Elfie said, this routine is just jam full of difficulty. Here's the highlight to her beam routine. A full twisting summy in combination. Round off just a little bit off, but we'll give it to her. That's a tough move. She has such variety in difficult skills and also the beauty of her choreography. And as Tim mentioned, Great leg extension, her toes are always pointed. I'm amazed at the poise and abilities of a 15-year-old. She has trained this routine more than one time, let me tell you. <laughs> she has spent countless hours going over this routine. It's not over yet. She has one other skill, her dismount, another combination. It seems like the whole routine is made up of combinations. moving quite easily, and here comes right here, the end of her routine. It'll take the entire length of the balance beam. Round off, back handspring, oh! Oh, oh, oh. Oh, but Zella Pukina up in a hurry. 
Wow. Wow, you, you really don't like to see falls like that. That was pretty, that was scary. Bad news, bad news. Well, Ooh. let's hope the tears are tears of disappointment and not from pain and agony. She looked to jump up right in a hurry. This was truly an exciting skill. I don't believe I've seen any athlete do it in the world today. Ariel Cartwell took two layouts in, the, in a row, but this was frightening. The combination dismount. And you see that foot just doesn't get down on the beam. Oh, God. you don't like to see that. But you do like to see her sitting up. Her score and those were teammates right after this. Well, the good news is Svetlana Zelopukina appears to be all right in the team.